I'm actually interested to see. Speaking of tires, that guy's got a flat tire right there. Look at that. Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Today is a sad day. Well, it's good, but it's sad because um, if you're like me and you hate winter, winter is coming and I gotta put the snow tires on the car. So I'm on my way right now. I originally wanted the um, Nokian, the R3s, those uh, whatever they're called, long name starts with an H right here. One of those, uh, but I checked everywhere, Cal Tire, a bunch of different places. They're so popular, especially that size for the uh, Model 3, that they're sold out everywhere in the country, apparently, I found out last week. Uh, the only way you can get it was in the States. I was going to go there, thanks to my friend Gary, but then that didn't work out. And it, Long story. Sorry, Gary, by the way. So what I ended up doing was going for the Michelin Excise. Now, the Michelin Excise, I've had that on the Kia for the last three winters. Great tire. I have no issues with that. I just wanted to try the Nokia's because everyone spoke so highly of it. So we're going there now. We're going to a place in Burlington, which is Halton, where I live. Nearby, I don't have to go all, all the way over to the States. Sorry, Gary. Uh, so we're going there. Uh, it's a place called 905 Tires. I'll put the link to the description and the address and everything like that. Uh, in the description below. We're going there now, we're gonna see if they can let us uh, film. I mean, not that it's hugely exciting, big, huge truck, hugely exciting to, uh, you know, get tires on, but I wanna see the process of how they do it with this whole um, uh, Tesla, how they have those little spots, those little individual spots where you can only jack up from with these hockey pucks. They have their own, so I don't need these, but uh, these are gonna be for myself in the future. They've done a lot of Model 3s. I have no doubt that they'll be able to do it, no problem. I have faith in them. So we're gonna go check it out, and uh, I just wanna see, because uh, you know, if you don't do it right, not that they're not gonna do it right, but just so you know, folks, if you don't do this right, you're uh, liable to puncture your battery, which is never a good thing for anyone in any situation. Autopilot, you gotta love it. So follow me there. Let's go check out uh, if they'll let me film. They're nice people on the phone, so I don't see why not. I uh, just have to, you'll see a lot of blurring faces probably. What happens if you don't use those jack pads? Well, it's just not good because you can break off. Uh, there's the plastic liner under there yeah. where the battery wires run. Yeah. Uh, there's a battery tray too. I mean, you can just the pack itself. Yeah. Okay, folks, that's it. It's simple. The tires are done. And uh, now, time to go home. And, uh, I'll let you know what the regen is like, because I hear regen, you lose your regen. For the first little while with these uh, new winter tires, or any kind of tires you put on that are different than the Tesla ones. So we'll see. Only one problem. Uh, the summer tires, there too, two are in the trunk, and there's Quinton. <laughs> he had to uh, come with us because someone's sick today, so he stayed home from school. So. These are the tires, uh, hopefully, let me know if the tires come in your way, okay buddy? Like if they run you over. Okay, so far so good. People say that you hear a lot of road noise and stuff like that with the winter tires, which you do normally, but um, I haven't heard, I mean, I've been driving for like five kilometers and I haven't heard much difference, maybe a little bit louder, but not much difference in road noise. I can't say that it's too much more. The regen uh, comes and goes. Sometimes there's regen, sometimes there isn't. Uh, so, just have to deal with that. Sorry, I don't know what happened there. You fell there for a second. So yeah, so the regen, just have to get used to it. Here are the summer tires. You ever wonder about the uh, sponge? So you think you're sponge worthy? Yes, I think I'm sponge worthy. I think I'm very sponge worthy. For the insulation inside the tire, I don't know if you can see it there, but that is the sponge. That's the spongy insulation that uh, deadens the noise. And we are home, folks. 
uh, excuse the nasty, nasty, ugly, dirty tire and rim. But uh, these are the Michelin Excise, as you can see. Excise right there. 235, 45, 18s. And there they are, folks. You just got to wash them and clean them. And uh, the car itself needs a nice wash. But those are my tires ready for the winter. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one, guys. Sorry, you fell there for a second. Let me uh